when you do this coaching with me, we're going to go deeper. And so today is, is going deeper. We're going to talk about feel it to heal it. And I got to tell you, I already have a lump in my throat. I'm already feeling super emotional about it. Um, and I'm okay with it because I know that when I'm feeling things and I just let it flow, that then I'm not holding it in. And it's just like, here we go. And um, one of my gifts is that I can hold space for people. And oftentimes what I'm feeling is for the collective or the group and holding space here for you today. And sometimes it's my own stuff that comes up. Either way, um, we're all connected. We're all one. And my pain is your pain in some way. And your pain is my pain in some way, meaning the details are different. But the truth is we've all experienced pain in our lives. It's the human experience. Um, and I'm not sure why I believed most of my life that life um, wasn't painful or that if life was hard or painful, it must, it meant that I somehow was getting it wrong or messed up and I was being punished. Um, but I know better now. I know that that's not true. I know that feeling all the feelings and processing our emotions is part of the experience. And one thing I did touch on um, in my live workshop was rupture and what it means to rupture. And it's really the breaking. And that is an experience that we experience in life no matter what. So we're going to dig deep into that today. I'm so glad you're here. This is one that you're you're going to be happy that you showed up for. It's going to be um, deep and rich. And here we are on Valentine's Day. So again, thank you for being here. So in true fashion and form and how we always get started, I'm going to invite you to find a quiet place. If you're driving your car, of course, that's the most important thing. Or if you're not in a place that you can find stillness, I'm just going to invite you to get as, as connected and as present as you can, okay? Just for the next couple of minutes. So if you have anything in your hand, just put it down and just sit, sit up tall and start to feel your sits bones in the seat, chair, whatever's beneath you. Start to feel that. Okay. All right. And just sit and close your eyes. Start with closing your eyes. Oh, and just feel your breath. Just come to that space, your breath. and fill your breath and as you do see if you can feel your lungs expanding your ribs and see if when you exhale you can really just push the air out of your belly you can push it out of your lungs taking in the biggest breaths that you've taken in today And now I want you to find your heart. And you can do that by putting your right hand on your heart if you'd like. Or you can just feel your heart beating beneath your chest. But I want you to connect with your heart. And thoughts will come. Just notice those thoughts. But think about thoughts as. You're looking at a river and the water is going down stream and the thought is the leaf that falls into the river and you just watch that leaf keep going down the river. So as thoughts start to come, I want you to just imagine them moving down the river and letting them go and coming back to your heart space. And connect with you today. We're going to start by checking in physically. So on a scale of zero to 10, do a body scan and ask yourself, how am I feeling today physically? And 
And again, there's never any judgment here. It's just awareness, just noticing. How's your body feeling? And when you get that number on a scale of zero to 10, just notice. And if there's a specific place in your body, I invite you to connect with that space that might be tight or uncomfortable and just breathe air into that space, creating space. You might even imagine white light filling that space. Just allow yourself to feel that feeling of expansion and light. And coming back to that heart beating beneath your hand or your chest. And now check in with your thoughts, check in with your mental mindset today. How are you feeling mentally? And if you were to of zero to 10, what might that number be? So on a scale of zero to 10, Give it a number. Where are your thoughts today? Maybe you've got lots going on in your head. There's a lot to do. It's a busy day. Maybe you're finding more stillness and quiet than normal. And either way, you're just noticing, where am I? And now I'm going to ask you to imagine that water, that stream again, and those thoughts just going down the river like leaves. Just let it go. See if you can create some stillness in your mind. Being the observer watching those thoughts drift down the river. Now I want you to check in with your emotions. Place your hand on your heart if it's not already there. And just feel you, connect with you. And ask yourself, how am I feeling emotionally? Again, there's no judgment here, just checking in with yourself, seeing how you feel today with no expectations of how you should feel. Just how do you feel? Might feel light, might feel heavy. Might be a lot of joy and there might be sadness. Just notice. Now I want you to put your left hand on your belly. It can be your solar plexus or your sacral, but just somewhere on your belly and your right hand on your heart. I want you to connect with yourself and I invite you to say one kind thing to yourself. And now repeat that. And one more time. And take another deep breath in. And this time on the exhale, let it be audible. We're going to do that again. Take in your biggest inhale of the day, expanding your ribs and lungs. 
And on the exhale, an audible exhale. One more time, inhale. And exhale. When you're ready, I want you to slowly blink open your eyes. And grab that pen and just write down physical, mental, and emotional. Where are you in this moment right now? How am I feeling physically on a scale of zero to 10? How am I feeling mentally on a scale of zero to 10? And then how are you feeling emotionally on a scale of zero to 10? And again, the reason we do this is because if you don't know where you are and you don't check in with yourself, how can you take action to shift or change that in any way? And maybe you don't want to, maybe you just notice you're like, wow, this meditation practice is actually helping me. I'm able to let my thoughts go down the river in a way that before it felt like I couldn't sit on the pillow for 10 seconds. Or maybe you're feeling like, you know what? I could use a little stretching today. My body feels tight. Or I'm feeling some soreness in my muscles because I did that workout. Again, you're just noticing. And today, as you notice where you are emotionally, I want to give you permission to feel whatever you get to feel in the next 45 minutes we have together. And let it bubble up. Let it come up. You're safe. And part of this process of feel it to heal it means that as it comes up, we let it. Okay, so I'm going to invite you to do that today. 